Hello everyone, today I'm going to be talking about why you need to stop telling people all your plans and how you can ultimately become mysterious. A lot of people make the mistake of telling random people their life plans and I'm going to be talking about why you shouldn't do that and also what things to keep to yourself. First of all, people can't ruin what they don't know. Say for example, you're in a friend group and a couple of them friends are a little bit toxic. Imagine you started dating someone and then you told the entire group about any time you and your boyfriend had an argument. Now them toxic people know all those details and if they're toxic enough, they will use that information against you and your boyfriend. This is obviously just an example, but this is the type of thing people do and the lows that people can go to because what they don't know, they can't use against you. A lot of the times people will be having a conversation with someone and they're just getting to know them and they don't know them very well. If the conversation comes to a stop or if the conversation has become a bit awkward and someone needs to start saying something to keep it going a lot of the time people like to talk about their personal issues or their struggles or their life or even sometimes their secrets just to keep the conversation going even though you don't know this person yet you need to have people in your friend group who you literally trust with your life if you don't trust them 150 percent you shouldn't be telling them all of your big details or life goals or things like that because people are going to use things against you in life this might be a toxic take and this is just my opinion i think that you should go into anything thinking that the person is going to use things against you to kind of stop yourself from oversharing because some humans can literally be horrible and if someone doesn't like you they will go to the lowest of lows to ruin your life and if they know something about you they will use that against you go into any situation thinking that someone is your enemy and that all they're looking for is a little bit of information about your life so that they can use it against you even though this might be toxic this is literally going to stop you from oversharing now some of the bad things about oversharing is that i've talked about this in a podcast episode my podcast is called my life unedited go and listen and subscribe to it on all podcast platforms but i talked about this in an episode a long time ago and i was talking about how if someone's really really passionate about something and this has happened to me as well if someone is super super passionate about something so say that you have a really big goal and you go and tell a bunch of people who are not ambitious at all they are going to literally put you down for having that goal because they cannot perceive themselves achieving that goal a lot of the time people's hatred is a reflection of their own trauma or their own lifestyle or their own insecurities so a lot of the time if someone believes that they can't truly do something and if they believe that they are just going to live an average life and they don't have any goals for themselves and they believe that they can't achieve any goals they are going to tell you that thing because that's their perception of themselves they don't even they can't even perceive anything more than that so if you go up to them and you start telling them all of these goals and all of your desires they're going to instantly put you down because they can't even physically think anything past what they currently are living life like so this is why i don't tell people any of my goals if i tell the wrong people my goals they're gonna put me down and make me feel bad for trying because that is just what people are like guys i swear there are people out here there is always someone who is going to talk you out of it if you have personal struggles if you have personal problems if you have a goal in life if you talk to people about it they're either going to use it against you or they're gonna put you down for it this is why i only talk to like-minded people about goals if i have a goal about making a certain amount of money i'm only going to be talking to people my age who make that amount of money so i can learn from them and grow i'm not going to start talking about all of this stuff to someone who isn't passionate and spends their entire life on video games because they cannot perceive more than that and they're going to put you down if you're someone like me who literally just doesn't take crap from anyone and, and you know you have that kind of mindset where it's like i'm gonna do it regardless of what you think you're all right but a lot of people are kind of you know sensitive to that kind of stuff and when people put them down that's like they literally don't want to do it anymore if they're working on a project and they have tons of positive feedback but one person is negative there's people out there that will literally stop the entire project because of that one negative person and you might be that person so this is why it's really important to pick and choose who you tell your information to because people are going to put you down and kind of put you off of the idea of continuing what you want to do so first of all don't worry about what anyone else thinks and i know that this is super generic but in life you have to have that mindset of like i'm going to do it regardless and this is the thing guys this is something that i was talking to someone about the other day in life if you do what other people want you to do you're going to be hated for it if you do what you want to do you're going to be hated for it so just do what you want to do regardless and don't think about them people who are putting you down but if you tell them people what you're trying to achieve they're going to put you down so there's no kind of there's 
there's no point of it, I guess. And also people can use things against you. Obviously, if you have something super personal going on in your life and you're trying to seek help and stuff and you have really, really good friends, it's okay to tell that kind of thing to people like that. But if you're just meeting someone, there's no reason to go above and beyond talking about your struggles or your problems in your life if you've just met them and they can't help you. If they can't help you fix the problem, why complain to them about it? Not everyone has your best interest at heart and that's just life. Don't tell people about your future plans or your future endeavors. Even if you've made plans for the future, keep it quiet. There's a quote that says, buy the land in private, build the house in private, and then have the housewarming party in public. Go on dates in private, propose in private, and then have the wedding publicly. Because no one needs to know how you got there, they just need to see the final result. But then again, a lot of time in life, you will grind, get up earlier than everyone else, work hard, learn, 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 grind, 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 and then at the end of it, people will call it luck. But it doesn't matter about them kind of people. But what I'm trying to say is people will use your word against you. And also people will use things against you all the time. And people will go to the lowest of lows to find out loads of little details about you and all of your weaknesses and then use that against you so then they can have an upper hand. So if you have truly, truly good friends who you can trust with everything, it's okay telling them a little thing here and there. But if you're just meeting someone or if there's someone who you don't quite vibe with on that level, don't start talking about your personal problems or don't don't start talking about your private life or your family issues or what you're going to do in the future or your goals or your desires or your dreams because first of all they're probably not going to help you achieve any of that or get over any of that or they're also not going to really care because that's just people like it's harsh but literally no one cares and i had to find this out the hard way when i was first starting youtube i was so passionate about it and i thought that everyone else would kind of share that same passion so when i started talking to people about it and people would tell me yeah well you're not gonna you're not gonna do it you know that's when i was like oh like i'm eight years old why are you a grown adult literally telling me i'm not going to be able to achieve but whatever but that just goes to show people's minds Mindsets. like people don't share the same mindset as you and if they don't don't tell them your plans because they're gonna put you down and they're gonna try and put you off of what you're trying to do don't listen to them guys also remember i had to learn this a hard way as well everybody knows everybody so if you start gossiping about someone they probably are best friends with the person you're gossiping about and you don't even realize it basically the point of this video was a reminder that people are going to use your word against you so don't start telling people all of your plans for the future all of your personal problems all of your personal issues issues because they do not need to know. It's also an advantage having things in secret, in private, only things you know or only you, things that you and a very, very trusted person know about. Obviously, disclaimer, if you're like actually going through something and you actually need help, like obviously talk to someone about it. But I'm talking about things like if you just want to talk crap about people, if you want to gossip or if you want to talk to people about your future plans or your goals or your dreams, there's two things here. If you're gossiping, if you're talking bad about people, it's going to get bad around to the person bad karma is going to come back to you if you tell people about your future plans a lot of the time people could not perceive themselves any higher than what they see themselves already as if there's someone who literally sits on video games all day they have no dreams for life if you're telling that kind of person what your big dreams are they are going to put you down and if you don't have a strong mindset you're going to get affected by that and therefore you're going to get hooked up into the mindset of oh then i shouldn't do it because they've said i shouldn't do it but da -da -da. remember that people can literally only perceive as far as their personal life goes so anytime someone's hating on you this is actually a little bit of a secret if someone is hating on you they're actually projecting their own insecurities because a lot of the time people People will make you feel bad so that they can feel better about themselves and this is exactly what they're gonna do if you tell them too much information and too many plans. I love you guys, see you in the next video.